I just learned it myself. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So if Kevin is the anchor, this is in the wrong position, but to see now, yeah. I can just have it come right off. See, it's not going to help me at all. Now, if he's the anchor, if I flip it around, and this is part of your training that you have to tell your employees. Now, most people just leave it on the rope once it's on. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because your anchor, this is always going to be going to the anchor. Correct. That's never going to change. Right. Because the other end is just doesn't have anything on it. Now, this is gravity driven, so it'll move as I move. Yeah. But if I fall, it does catch. It catches. Mm -hmm. See what I'm saying? Exactly. So this is a gravity driven one. So as I move, and occasionally you'll have to move it for you. It depends on how much tension you have in your line. But the length of your rope is vital. Um, in fact, I'm going to set up the whiteboard and show you why. But that's a rope grab, okay? Now, this does not have a decelerator in it. See how there's nothing in here but the rope? Remember the dummy drop? Mm -hmm. Okay. This does not have a decelerator. Like These a have thing. decelerators. Yeah, this. Yeah. Those deploy and slow my fall down. Yeah, gotcha. Okay? This is just a strict full, strict position restraint, okay? So there's a zillion different <coughs> brands and there's a zillion different components. You just have to know what you want, okay? This one gives you the option of putting a lanyard on here, okay? Now. That's what's, what's a lanyard, sorry. This is a lanyard. This is a lanyard right here, correct. So you go find it from the worker yeah. to yeah. that. So this right. is right. back and forth. To your harness. Right. Yep. Right. So. When we're in the equipment and we have the opportunity to be catapulted out, we want not the dog leash. We want to have the decelerator and a 5,000 pound anchor because we're going to swing underneath the equipment.